what is success? Success is being able to live life happy with prosperity and being able to manifest mindfulness. Having something you're passionate about. It's very important for us all to have passions and goals in life. Too many people out there are living in lack because they think they can't do it. Um, because they have people in their lives telling them they're not good enough. Um, I had to deal with that a lot in my life in the past, especially. And drama. Drama with family, friends. All these things are distractions to our ultimate goals in life to be successful. And like I've always said, before financial success becomes being comfortable in our own shoes and in our own bodies. We're all beautiful human beings. We all have great things to give to the world. It's all about manifesting it and getting out of our own heads. For years, I was stuck in my own head until I learned about the principles of the laws of attraction. And I started applying it to my life by manifesting mindfulness and it helped me get through a lot of hard times in life and it helped me turn my life around. So now I don't live in lack and now I don't think about resentment or anger and I don't get stuck up in my head thinking about the past. Our minds can create uh, beautiful things like to, you know the computers we use today, the phones, Someone invented all that. There's different people who invented all that stuff. Don't ever let anybody tell you that you can't accomplish something. We all have people in our lives that try to degrade, that degrade us in life or try to make us feel like we're not good enough. But it's all about how we think. What we think we become, what we think our life becomes, what we think about we do, and what we think about we don't do. If we're able to start with setting goals and reminders to practice with mindfulness, keeping negative thoughts out of our heads, staying away from angry people that bring you down, spitefulness. I don't understand people like that. Um, I don't think anybody does. But we all have our own paths in life and our own choices and decisions. And I know a lot of people out there want to have a good life like myself. And it's all about how you think about it. We all are writing our own stories of our lives. And your story is not over with and mine's not either. All you have to do is manifest it. Pretty much like dreaming it. And projecting it into your life. Just like before you get home at the end of the day, before you walk in that door to your loved one, to your family, not bringing that negative energy home with you or from the argument earlier that day. Being able to put a smile on your face and open that door and project positivity and love is powerful. The way we think our feelings, our nervousness, our positive vibes are all picked up on by people. You go out in public and you got a big smile on your face. I'm sure you all remember when this has happened. People, everyone comes into your path with a smile on their face and welcomes you with open arms. A lot of times we don't realize it, but when we're thinking, it puts a look on our face like that it's un unapproachable kind of people that stands people, we look standoffish. You can tell when someone's a thought. Now, if we can apply the principles of the laws of attraction and the way we think, thinking more abundance and happiness and success, success first coming with being happy in our own shoes and skin, now that's powerful. And that's gonna change lives. Our brains are like a computer. We 
we can set it to whatever we want. But old moods, past emotions, experiences get put on auto project mode. That's why people wake up in the past feeling lack, depressed, feeling not good enough. The truth is you can do whatever you put your mind to. You can do whatever you put your mind to. And if you have anybody holding you back, any relationships or anything, get up from underneath them. Get away. Because we all have one life and we have many chances. It's so important to start becoming more aware of how you think. You'll notice if you look across YouTube and the internet, you're going to find professionals out there that are talking just like I am about manifesting mindfulness and the laws of attraction. We attract what we think into our lives. If we, if we are, if we are uh, thinking good things and we are feeling confident, even if you don't feel confident, fake it till you make it, you're going to project good things into your life, maybe the love of your life or good people or a good job. Remember, it's the power of our mind and how we think is what determines the outcome of our lives. And you have the power, just like I do. Everyone has a good uh, evening and day. Um, please subscribe. I appreciate that. And have a good uh, night.